hello friends in this video i will show you how to pick a pdf file and display its pages in an image view in android studio so here i have this app in which i have this button one which is for picking pdf files then i have this text view one which is for displaying the page which is being displayed and the total number of pages then I have this button 2 which is for moving to previous page and button 3 this is for moving to the next page and then I have this image view with ID image view and for this I have set the scale type to fit center the background color is white margin 8 dp and elevation 8 dp so in this image view I will display the pages now let's move to main activity.java here at the top i have declared a text view text view one and image view one this image view is image view one now in on create method i have defined button one button two and button three using their ids button one two and three and then i have defined text view one and image view one using the ids text view one and image view then when button one is clicked i pick a pdf file so i have this on click listener for button one and inside this i define an intent with action open document and then i add category intent dot category openable and i set the type for this intent to application slash pdf and this is the mime type which we use for picking pdf file application slash pdf and then i use start activity for result intent comma pick file this pick file is the request code which we use for the intent to pick the pdf file and this is an int variable which i have defined at the top public static file final int pick file equal to 99 so once we click on button 2 and pick the file the next event will be on activity result this is outside on create and in on activity result we have these variables request code result code and intent variable data so if the request code is equal to pick file and result code is equal to result ok then if data is not equal to null so then we can get the uri of the pdf file using this code uri is equal to data dot get data then i have this try catch exception block or code and inside this i define a parcel file descriptor using the uri of the pdf file so parcel file descriptor is equal to get content resolver dot open file descriptor uri comma mode r this is a string variable r so here I use the URI of the PDF file to get a parcel file descriptor. Now after this, I define a PDF renderer which will be used to read the PDF file. So for that, I have, I have a few variables declared here. Here I have declared a PDF renderer called renderer and then the int variable total pages which is equal to zero and another int variable display page which is also equal to zero so here in on activity result first i get the parcel file descriptor using the uri then i define renderer is equal to new pdf renderer parcel file descriptor here i use this parcel file descriptor in this pdf renderer so once we got the pdf render we can get the pages of the pdf so first we get the page count and here i've set total pages is equal to renderer dot get page count and then i set display page equal to zero and then i display this display page using this code underscore display display page and then i catch file not found exception and io exception so this underscore display display page is a new method which i have de defined here private void underscore display int 
variable underscore n. So in this method, if renderer is not null, then I define a page PDF renderer dot page called page is equal to renderer dot open page number underscore n. So if I have to display page zero, it will open page zero here. If I have to display page ten, it will open page ten renderer dot open the page number which I want to open. So once I get the page, then I define or I create a bitmap. Bitmap m bitmap is equal to bitmap dot create bitmap page dot get width comma page dot get height comma bitmap dot config dot argb underscore double eight double eight. So this will create a bitmap with the width and height of the page, and then I render the page on the bitmap means first i create a bitmap with width and height of the page and then i draw the page on the bitmap page dot render m bitmap comma null comma null comma pdf render dot page dot render mode for display and once we go got the page on a bitmap we can display the bitmap in image view so here i display this m bitmap in image view one image view one dot set image bitmap m bitmap and then i close this page here i opened or defined the page and here i close the page and then i display the page number which is underscore n so here i display underscore n plus one plus this symbol plus total pages in text view one so initially when file is picked i display page 0 then if the user clicks on button 2 then if display page is more than 0 then i decrease the display page by 1 and display the display page if button 3 is clicked or next button is clicked then if display page is less than total pages minus 1 I increase the display page by one and display the display page. Okay, and in the end, when user exits the app, the on destroy method will be executed. And here, if renderer is not equal to null, then I close the renderer. Renderer dot close. Okay, now let's have a look at the app. So here is the app, here when I click on the previous button, nothing happens, when I click on next button, nothing happens, when I click on pick file, I can pick a PDF file only. So here I have this PDF file, when I click on this, it opens it and displays the first page. When I click on next button, it displays the second page, then third, fourth and so on. Okay, this is the fourth page, third, second, first page, and then if I click again, it shows nothing. Okay, and like this, I can move to next pages. So that's all in this video. Thank you very much for watching this.